Modern Warfare Season 5 is here. I'm up way earlier than I normally am. <laughs> normally right now I'd be getting my beauty to sleep, but now I just, I probably look really ugly. But sleep is for the week when Modern Warfare Season 5 is here. You can already see some of the Shadow Company stuff in the top left. I mean, I'm so ready, dude. Leading up to Modern Warfare Season 5, you know, I've already seen the roadmap. I posted about it in the YouTube community tab. And Infinity Ward has already released the patch notes, so we kind of know some of the stuff that's going to be in the game ahead of time. I think one of the coolest things that's going to be in this Modern Warfare update is weapon inspects that's just coming back. Just kind of out of nowhere, they're bringing back weapon inspections. Oh, we have a trailer. That's a big boy. Oh my god. They're gonna blow up in the stadium. <laughs> oh my god, look at it go. I'm telling you, dude, the COD 2020 trailer is gonna be inside. Intent, you are clear to engage. Oh, there's the A94 too. Oh my god. Okay, that's got me pretty hyped. I'm excited, dude. Oh my god, wow. The background's so different already. <laughs> Looks like we're in the airport this time around. What is this golem skin? Oh my god, that hat though. I don't know, that's kind of ugly, man. <laughs> Eternal Samurai. Oh, is this how you get the akimbo blades? Yeah, so with season five, they've added akimbo swords. I don't know if I'm gonna check this out quite yet. Because with this video, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna cover the new A94 assault rifle. Oh my god, there's so many bundles. Holy sh. All right, so I'm here on the season five battle pass. Let's see exactly when you get the different guns. Well, you get the SMG at 15. Okay, so I'm pretty sure the assault rifle is gonna be at what, 31? Okay, I'm gonna have to buy myself to 31 if we're gonna be covering the AN94. I'm gonna go ahead and get the battle pass bundle, but I'm gonna have to get some extra tiers too. Oh my god. That Shadow Company Season 5 logo, though. That put me to 20. I've got the new SMG, at least. I'm gonna cover that in a different video, though. I'm gonna buy 11 tiers. Oh, God. All right, there we go. Buying the next 11 tiers. <laughs> Did I get anything new? Oh, it's I got a new horn. Wait, no. War, what is a war track? Is this music? Oh, my God. They basically threw the Juggernaut music into the vehicles now. That is so badass. I think it's a little too early in the morning to be doing this, though. <laughs> Ooh, that is a really cool skin for the Tack Rover, though. The Shadow Company stuff looks so badass. It's almost like having Obsidian camo for your vehicles. I don't know. I'm, I'm kind of torn. I mean, that looks pretty badass, but I mean, this is obviously the cooler one. Decisions, decisions. <laughs> oh my god, imagine having the pink anime truck, but then you hear this music coming by. <laughs> I'm definitely putting that on. <laughs> okay, but I'm gonna put the A94 on a class. I mean, we gotta check it out. Here's the A94, cutting edge Russian assault rifle with a unique hyper burst feature. The initial shot from each trigger pull fires a rapid two round burst before perceived recoil is felt, creating a tightly grouped cluster with increased damage potential. This mechanism is fed by a canted magazine and a reciprocating receiver helps keep control of the recoil. Dude, I'm so ready. I can't wait to use this. Obviously, before I bring the A94 online, I'm gonna test it out in private match, see what kind of attachments we can put on it. I'm so ready, man. Let's go. All right, let's see what kind of attachments we have for the A94. This oh, wait, what? The A94 sonic break. Basically helps control the recoil without making it sound too loud. That's definitely interesting. Got all kinds of different barrels and stuff. Typical lasers. As far as it goes for sights, I mean, can we put a scope on it? Oh yeah, you can put a sniper scope on it. <laughs> as far as it goes for a stock, I mean, there's all kinds of different stocks. Folded stock, you say. The folded stock looks pretty cool. How it's like folded in. Under barrel. We have all the same like kind of under barrel attachments. Ammunition, you can get 45 round mags or 60 round casket mags. Same kind of grips. And as far as it goes for perks, I mean, we, okay, it's a very standard gun. Doesn't look like there's anything too crazy. I'm gonna try out the sonic break attachment though. Look at this beast of a gun. I mean, this thing's gonna destroy people. <laughs> oh my god, that looks so weird in the preview. It just looks like a pistol, looks like a handgun. The N94 looks so different. I mean, look at those iron sights. It's very unique. I mean, how do we inspect it though? I've gotta learn how to actually inspect this thing. Oh my god. Oh, dude, it is so powerful. What? That was with only 40 rounds? This thing slaps. Good God. And if you tap fire and get that extra like two round burst, like the faster firing shot. Oh my God, this thing is gross. Which by the way, there's a really cool new feature. And I think stopping power rounds is going to be really good in season five. Apparently if you use stopping power now and you die and drop your gun, the stopping power rounds will still be in the gun. I think that's a really nice feature. I mean, you'll be able to pick up your gun and still have the stopping power round so it doesn't go to waste. I think that might get me to change off a of dead silence, at least for a little bit. I mean, we'll have to see how it goes. This thing is gonna be so good online. I mean, obviously I'm gonna have to get some attachments, but we'll take this thing online. We'll get some attachments, try to hit some feeds because the AN94 is gonna be destroying people. Okay, so apparently for PS4, all you have to do to do the weapon inspect is hold left on the D-pad and then you'll do a weapon inspect. Oh my, and it blurs too. Oh my God, that is so nice. I am so fucking ready, dude. That is so clean. I mean, that is like the best. That is seriously the best. I wonder if tap firing the AN is gonna make it a little bit better though because of like the faster fire rate. I mean, that's, oh my God. Yeah, okay, we gotta use this thing online. I actually lost one to 169 <laughs> against the bot. But yeah, the A94, I mean, this thing has an insane time to kill. Again, this is just my initial impressions. This is testing out against bots, but I feel like it's going to be really good. But using it online for the first time with no attachments on not shipment, I mean, we don't know how that's going to go. It'll probably be a little bit of a different story for a while. We have all these different game modes. I mean, I think I'll try out the new maps, but if I'm not really digging them too much or if I can't hit any feeds, I think I'll just, you know, put us in like hardcore DOM or something. But for now, let's check out some new maps too. Which by the way, while we're trying to look for a match, I just wanted to let you guys know that apparently there is going to be a live event happening in Warzone in the stadium involving COD 2020. I fucking called the guys. 
Because, I mean, I knew that there was something up. All right, we got some cranked on Suldal Harbor. I'm probably butchering that. This is looking so cool. This is actually a really nice looking map so far. Hopefully it plays well. I mean, we're looking for the next shipment, man. But yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to this live event. If it's exactly what I said it's going to be, then I mean, that's just crazy. I didn't have any kind of insider information or anything like that. I didn't get some kind of like secret leak. It's just a guess, man. It's just a coincidence that I actually got it right. <laughs> It's dropping them. It's so strong. Who's laying there? Come on, dude. But yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to this live event. I mean, I'm going to be recording a bunch of videos today, and then I'm going to be going live after. So if you're watching this video right now, check back on the channel. Check to see if I'm live and come join the chat. Come hang out in the stream, because I mean, we're going to be playing some more of the new update and stuff. And I don't know if this live event's going to happen today, but I mean, if it is, we're going to be streaming it. At least try to. I mean, if I can't stream, I'll at least record. I'll do something. Oh, got our first feed coming. Oh my, it's so good. We already got a quad feed first game on no attachments at all. I'm barely even awake and I'm hitting quad feeds with no attachments on new maps. Let's fucking go, lads. I need some more G fuel to wake up. So far, this map is not completely terrible. I mean, just initial impressions of it. I mean, it doesn't seem too bad. I hope I don't regret that later on. I got it to level six. So I mean, I have some different attachments now. And now we can inspect it. Oh my God. This is so awesome, man. It's a feature I kind of wish we had sooner, but I mean, I'm glad we have it now. God, it's slapping him. Oh. This thing is so good. I mean, this is disgustingly good. I'm just going to be completely honest here. I mean, if you want to go ahead and just buy your way up to tier 31, I would do it. You got to play the game to that. I mean, that was the quad fee right there. <laughs> I mean, you could grind your way to tier 31 if you want to, but I mean, the A94 is going to be really good. I mean, 23 to 7, 3 KD playing cranked. It's an okay first game on, I guess. <laughs> but honestly, the A94 is very strong. I mean, you might want that advantage right off the bat. It's fucking crazy. I mean, I got a quad fee with no attachments on a map I've never played before. All right, we got some TDM on the oil rig map. Someone is already level 71, bro. I think someone's been up since 5 a.m. Wait, who is that? That's a different skin. I thought that was a completely different person for a second. <laughs> All right, TDM on Petrov oil rig. Let's see if this is any good. All right, here we go. Oh my God, it looks like a... Uh... This looks like the, not necessarily sub base for Modern Warfare 2, or maybe it was. Oh my god, is it really though? Oh my god, I did not even recognize this. Is this the same oil rig for Modern Warfare 2? Or does it just look similar? I think it just looks similar. There's definitely a Hi, how are you? Are you kidding me? Who's got the riot shield on here? What are you doing? I think this oil rig is kind of like meant to look like the one from Modern Warfare 2, but I'm not seeing like any kind of identical resemblance. At least not initially. I mean, I can't really tell. Definitely an interesting looking map so far though. Surprise, mother... Oh my f***ing... Don't you dare. This is honestly a terrifying lobby so far. He's sniping. You're not gonna get me though. Wait, I almost have a quad feet. Wait, what? I want to get some bigger streaks going, but I mean, I don't really know the map that well. And there's some wonky ass play styles in here, man. I mean, we got the riot shield dude. He's actually just running around with a knife. It's going pretty good though. Wow, camp in the middle. He's, he, he's leaning back there? Come on, bro. No. He really did. For like five seconds. I mean, I guess if you have to get lean long shot challenges, that'll be the place to do it. Just didn't expect to see that my first game on this map. Oh my God. That is, that is a dangerous place right there. You can tell. He's already st he's still back there. Come on. Ugh. I don't know how I feel about this map. I mean, I don't know if it's the enemies, but not feeling it, Mr. Krabs. Nope. The reload though, dude. The way they switch the mags in the A94, I love it. Looks so clean. Oh. My fucking god. Two turtles, man. The two turtle doves. <laughs> Just teaming up together, doing some weird shit. I'm not awake enough to deal with people playing turtles. Come on, man. Fucking heart attack play style. I'm not trying to vomit this early in the morning. But then you have people like that. Proning in a second story area with the riot shield in their back. <laughs> Honestly, since it's just this early in the morning, I mean, it's just kind of funny. It doesn't really trigger me as much as it normally would. I think after this game, I'm definitely gonna try to do some hardcore dom with the AN. Try to play some maps where I already know the map flow so that way I can just kind of use the gun. It really does make a huge difference. In the corner, what a surprise. They're just waiting in the corners, man. It's ridiculous. <laughs> and I get knife to the back, come on. He was probably waiting there too. He was wait. Okay, he's waiting in a different spot. Oh my god, I I can't. <laughs> I'll play it through, but my god, I can't wait for it to be over. <laughs> that looks like a smiley face. That looks like a fucking smiley face. Incredible stuff, man. This is a great map. Got it to level twelve already? Are you kidding me? That is. Dope. I don't know where some of this energy is coming from. Like sometimes I'm just like half asleep and then I'm like really awake. Like the caffeine's hitting me in bursts or something. <laughs> like the two round burst of the A94. <laughs> oh Come on, just melt them. It's so hard to actually melt them when they have the shields stop it i'll drop you where is this fourth guy i know there's another guy oh my what are you doing 
What the fuck? I mean, that wasn't a completely terrible TDM. I got 26 kills. I just don't feel great about it. Like, even though I was the best on the team and we won, I just don't really feel like that was a great match. <laughs> Definitely could have been better. I mean, I think I like the other map more. See so, yeah, we're doing attachment wise. I mean, I haven't even used double weapon XP or anything. It's really interesting. I mean, I don't really want to rock a camo on this thing. At least not quite yet. I mean, maybe like red or blue tiger. Definitely gonna go for gold so we can get a platinum and Damascus camo. Oh my god. I can't wait. I can give it a try on some gunrunner. So far, the A94 feels very strong in core. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be a one shot very consistently in hardcore as well. So yeah, here we go. I mean, this thing should be really good. Go, push that spawn. Headshot feed. You're not playing. <laughs> I feel a quad headshot feed on people not even playing, bro. Oh my god, wake up! <laughs> it's not that early in the morning, god damn. <laughs> oh fuck. Dude. Go this way. Oh, come on. Nope. What the- what? How? Come on! <laughs> I can't believe I just failed that. I had an easier time getting the quad feeding core. Come on, just get- No, stop it. Oh my god, dude, the feed was right there. Come on, I can do this, I can do this. You know that dude's just camping right there. Another one right there. Let's go, there's a quad feed. Try to get more. Why is he climbing up there? What are you doing? I mean, at least I hit something. <laughs> Just, you know, when we're playing hardcore and stuff, I'm going for the huge feeds. There's about to be a feed here, but the game's about to end. No. Victory. One more feed. Oh, come on. Dang, dude. I mean, I was about to go off again. That was an okay match. I mean, it could have definitely played out better. Definitely some slow paced play styles on their team, but I mean, it also let me to get that feed. So 43 to 19. I mean, that's not bad. The A94 is definitely going to be good in core and hardcore. So, I mean, you could use it either way. The gun's amazing. But that's going to do it for this video. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me use the new A94 Modern Warfare. Definitely keep an eye on the channel today. Subscribe and turn on notifications if you don't want to miss new videos and when I'm going live with the live events or even just streaming in general. And with that being said, I really do hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did and you want to see some more, Modern Warfare Season 5 stuff, make sure to drop a like. I'll see you guys later.